Good kill, good kill. Hey, good kill. So if you're watching these videos and you want to get into DCS, definitely check out Apex Gaming PCs. This is where I got my laptop. I'm super happy with what I received. And keep in mind that they have the A-Firm program, which allows you to pay month to month so that it doesn't hurt your wallet too badly. Check out the links below to make your own custom PC that fits your budget. Big thank you to Apex Gaming PCs. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. We're here in the Sukhoi 35. This time we are flying under Iranian colors. This is Musolo's F, uh, sorry, SU-35 cockpit. Uh, not yet public. If you want it, I recommend you join his Discord. You'll see it there when it goes public. Links to all that in the video description below. Uh, this is theoretically a Sukhoi 35 Flinker-E, which represents the export variant of the uh, Sukhoi 35 into the merch here with the F-22. And this is a high off Boresight Fox 2 uh, fight. If I can just get the lock here, having a little bit of trouble with that. There we go, locked. Fox 2 comes off, missiles tracking, and unfortunately just can't make that turn. here also hasn't fired any Fox 2s although he's doing a really good job of jamming that Wes uh, keeping the weapon employment zone uh, locked up he's got a Fox 2 off I saw his Fox 2 there it goes just passed in front of me there uh, my Fox 2 hit the ground in front of me unfortunate I thought that missile would hit him for sure. Uh, he's back there, unfortunately. He's got my six, he's got a Fox 2 off, and it's tracking. Good kill, we'll eject here. I think my second Fox 2 there let me down. I'm, I'm really surprised that it didn't kill him. But yeah, good kill if they're flying through there. So there's been, uh, you know, rumors that Iran has received the Sukhoi 35s for a long time now. Uh, but now more than ever, considering the uh, circumstances in that area right now, uh, with all the Russian equipment that's been flown into the country, there's some speculation that at least some of those were some of these Sukhoi 35s. I don't know if that's true. I think it's a lot more complicated than just bringing these things in on a plane and hopping and throwing a guy in there and flying around. Uh, so I don't know if that's true, but you know, those are the rumors. Obviously I can not confirm anything, of course. I'm not there inventorying what's coming in. But unfortunately, this is a fight that could happen in the future, but hopefully not, right? We don't want that in real life. We'd like to just keep it in DCS if possible. Into the merge here. And once again, into that one circle turn. That F-22 nose is coming around pretty hard. And he's got... You know, one thing to consider as you watch these fights is the capability of the aircraft is not necessarily what will translate into the fight because you still have a guy sitting in the cockpit, right? Um, just because the aircraft can get a lock 90 degrees off bore sight, for example, doesn't necessarily mean the pilot will be able to achieve that in the moment, you know? 
uh, that's just the maximum capability of the aircraft, assuming the pilot can, again, extract that uh, performance out of the aircraft. The last round, I struggled to get a lock. Um, and I think that's what led to, and he did a better job of that. His, his aircraft got a lock and got the Fox 2 off. That's just how it goes sometimes. I was spamming the lock button, but it just wasn't locking them. So uh, here we go once again into the merge, F-22. And look at this, he's kind of out in front here, and my archers can do some real tight turns. Let me just roll over on top of him here, Fox 2, and beautiful track. I knew that would get him. Oh, 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 no, 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 <laughs> uh, that's the first time that's happened to me. Even when you kill the F-22, it still finds a way to kill you, I guess. <laughs> I literally saw a comment a couple weeks ago. I see I saw two or three comments of people asking, like, hey, if you shoot somebody down, can their the falling wreckage of their aircraft, can it damage your aircraft? And yes, apparently the answer is yes. So good to know. Avoid the other aircraft that's falling out of the sky after you shoot them down. That's a good lesson. Uh, into the merch here one more time. As we continue to look for this victory against the F-22, I think the last round is technically mine. Fox 2 again, that goes for flares. Unfortunate. Oh, look at that. Wow, we're tight here. I don't like that. Oh. Just rolls over and almost scores a gun kill on me. Look at him, he's kind of flat spinning here. As long as he doesn't get a Fox 2 lock here, everything's going to be fine. And here we go, we're looking for a lock. Couldn't get a lock. He's got a Fox 2 off that went underneath and missed. And if I can just roll the no- what? Ooh. His 9X came back around. His 9X did a loop, because he most definitely did not shoot another one and I just died. F-22 is a frustrating opponent. Whenever I've done this fight, the uh, Sukhoi 35 has always been a challenge for the F-22. Uh, back then, the 9Xs were not looping around, but uh, apparently they are now, so that's something you got to always consider. Continue to drop the uh, flares. There's some updated capabilities for the 9Xs. Uh, you got to be careful of that, apparently. Um, but the Sukhoi 35, like I said, almost always a challenge for the F-22 in the merge. Uh, ideally, the F-22 would want to long kill this thing in BVR before it ends up in a merge. Um, but if it does, you can see how dangerous the Super 35 can be. Into the merge here once again, I'm looking for the high ground. And I've got it here. Fox 2, look at that, super tight, wow! <laughs> oh, almost guns me, wow. Not cool.
last round when I killed him, I was trying to keep my separation so his body didn't crash into me again. And so I was focused on that and I wasn't expecting the gunshot. <laughs> It's always scary. It's like the F-22 will not just die without, you know, trying its best to take you with it every single time. It's frustrating. Um, but you can see how, like, min-ranged, how tight you have to be to the archers in order to min-range those things. You, that archer that hit him in the last fight barely traveled any distance to hit him. So uh, they're actually pretty incredible missiles. Uh, both the archer and the 9X, to be fair, into the merge here. Once again, I'm looking for that high ground. Just slicing up a little bit. This will be the last round, but it looks like the slice up kind of cost me some performance there, which I'm not a big fan of. I've got a lock here. And for some reason, my missile's not coming off. I'm squeezing it, it's not coming off. Uh, I think he shot off a 9X, but it didn't look like it tracked. Uh, I got oh, this again. I'm not a fan of this uh, 9x thing. <laughs> uh, they're quite annoying, actually. Uh, good kill. Good kill to the F22.